Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can join a Microsoft Teams meeting with ID and password. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. So as you can see guys, I'm right now in Microsoft Teams and this is how the homepage looks like. So once you open Microsoft Teams, here in the left, you're going to find all of the sections. You're going to find the activity section, community section, chat, and lastly the calendar if you go to the community section right here you're going to find all of your communities and if you want to create a new community all you need to do guys is click on the little plus icon at the top then once you do that you need to choose a category from here or you can just choose create my own then once you do that go ahead and choose a name for the community after that, you need to choose the description and then you can also add a community avatar. Once you do that, you can scroll down right here. You can edit the community guidelines. You can also enable or, or disable requiring approval to join. So go ahead and make sure to enable that if you want to require approval to join. And right here, you're going to find visibility. You can either enable it or disable it. And then go ahead and click on create and the community will be created. As you can see guys, right here in the top right corner, you're gonna find the option to invite people. You can also invite people by clicking right here. Then you can just send them uh, a link or you can just add them directly by entering their name, email or phone number. Then select them and click on invite. So right now, let's say you want to join a private meeting that requires password and ID to join. All you need to do guys is just click on the link. You're gonna find it in the channel or if you receive it, just go ahead and click on the link and then you're gonna be able to join the meeting. Before joining the meeting, you need to add or enter the password that you already have. So just enter the password and then click join and you're gonna be able to join the meeting. So this is it guys for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.